CIET NCERT presents Audiobook of Mathematics for Class 6 Chapter 13 Symmetry Page 261 Part 1 13.1 Introduction Symmetry is quite a common term used in day-to-day -day life. When we see certain figures with evenly balanced proportions, we say they are symmetrical. Here we have two pictures of two monuments. The first one, Taj Mahal in Uttar Pradesh and the second one, Thiruvannamalai in Tamil Nadu. These pictures of architectural marvel are beautiful because of their symmetry. Suppose we could fold a picture in half such that the left and right halves match exactly when the picture is said to have line symmetry. We have figure 13.1 given here which shows the same. We can see that the two halves are mirror images of each other. If we place a mirror on the fold, then the image on one side of the picture will fall exactly on the other side of the picture. When it happens, the fold, which is the mirror line, is a line of symmetry or an axis of symmetry for the picture. Page 262 The shapes you see here are symmetrical. Why? When you fold them along the dotted line, one half of the drawing would fit exactly over the other half. How do you name the dotted line in the figure 13.1? Where will you place the mirror for having the image exactly over the other half of the picture? Again, another figure given here, figure 13.2, is not symmetrical. Can you tell why not? 13.2 Making Symmetric Figures Ink Blot Devils do this. Take a piece of paper, fold it in half, spill a few drops of ink on one half side. Now press the halves together. What do you see? Is the resulting figure symmetric? If yes, where is the line of symmetry? Is there any other line along which it can be folded to produce two identical parts? Try more such patterns. Next to this we see the picture of a paper with few drops of ink which has been folded in half. Inked string patterns. Fold a paper in half. On one half portion, arrange short lengths of string dipped in a variety of colored inks or paints. Now press the two halves. Study the figure you obtain. Is it symmetric? In how many ways can it be folded to produce two identical halves? Try these. You have two set squares in your mathematical instruments box. Are they symmetric? List a few objects you find in your classroom such as the blackboard, the table, the wall, the textbook, etc. Which of them are symmetric? and which are not. Can you identify the lines of symmetry for those objects which are symmetric? Page 263 Exercise 13.1 1. List any four symmetrical objects from your home or school. 2. For the given figure, which one is the mirror line, L1 or L2? Next to the question, we have a figure. 3. Identify the shapes given here. Check whether they are symmetric or not. Draw the line of symmetry as well. In a rectangular box, we have six different figures. A, B, C, D, E and F. 4. Copy the following on a squared paper. A square paper is what you would have used in your arithmetic notebook in earlier classes. Then complete them such that the dotted line is the line of symmetry. Again we have six different figures here drawn on squared paper. 
A, B, C, D, E and F. 5. In the figure, L is the line of symmetry. Complete the diagram to make it symmetric. We have the figure here showing L as the line of symmetry. Page 264. In the figure, L is the line of symmetry. Draw the image of the triangle and complete the diagram so that it becomes symmetric. Next to the question, we have another figure with L as the line of symmetry. 13.3 Figures with two lines of symmetry. Do this. A kite. One of the two set squares in your instrument box has angles of measure 30 degrees, 60 degrees, 90 degrees. Take two such identical set squares, place them side by side to form a kite, like the one shown here. How many lines of symmetry does the shape have? Do you think that some shapes have more than one line of symmetry? Next to this we have the two set squares placed next to each other to form a kite. A rectangle. Take a rectangle sheet, like a postcard. Fold it once lengthwise, so that one half fits exactly over the other half. Is this fold a line of symmetry? Why? Open it up now and again fold on its width in the same way. Is this second fold also a line of symmetry? Why? Next to this we have the picture of the postcard showing the first fold and the second fold. Do you find that these two lines are the lines of symmetry? Try these. Form as many shapes as you can by combining two or more set squares. Draw them on squared paper and note their lines of symmetry. A cut out from double fold. Take a rectangular piece of paper. Fold it once and then once more. Draw some designs as given here. Cut the shape drawn and unfold the shape. Before unfolding, try to guess the shape you are likely to get. How many lines of symmetry does the shape have which has been cut out? Create more such designs. Page 265 13.4 Figures with multiple, more than two lines of symmetry. Take a square piece of paper, fold it into half vertically, fold it again into half horizontally, that is, you have folded it twice. We have this picture of this square piece of paper being folded vertically and horizontally. Now open out the folds and again fold the square into half, for a third time now, but this time along a diagonal, as shown in the figure. Again, open it and fold it into half for the fourth time, but this time along the other diagonal, as shown in the figure. Open out the fold. How many lines of symmetry does the shape have? Next to this, we have the picture of a triangle which shows three lines of symmetry for an equilateral triangle. We can also learn to construct figures with two lines of symmetry starting from a small part as you did in exercise 13.1, question 4, for figures with one line of symmetry. 1. Let us have a figure as given alongside. We have a figure of a curved body. 2. We want to complete it so that we get a figure with two lines of symmetry. Let the two lines of symmetry be L and M. Next to this, we see the two lines of symmetry L and M along the figure. 3. We draw the part as shown here to get a figure having line L as a line of symmetry. The same is shown in the figure adjacent to this. Page 266. 4. To complete the figure, we need it to be symmetrical about line M also. 
draw the remaining part of figure as shown. The same is being described in the figure given next to the question. This figure has two lines of symmetry, that is line L and line M. Try taking similar pieces and adding to them so that the figure has two lines of symmetry. Some shapes have only one line of symmetry, some have two lines of symmetry and some have three or more. Can you think of a figure that has six lines of symmetry? Symmetry, symmetry everywhere. Many road signs you see every day have lines of symmetry. Here are a few. We see a few road signs given here. Identify a few more symmetric road signs and draw them. Do not forget to mark the lines of symmetry. The nature has plenty of things having symmetry in their shapes. Look at these. We have pictures of few things from nature. The designs on some playing cards have line symmetry. Identify them for the following cards. We have two cards given here for this purpose. Here is a pair of scissors. How many lines of symmetry does it have? Next to this we have the picture of a pair of scissors. Page 267 Observe this beautiful figure. It is a symmetric pattern known as Coach's Snowflake. If you have access to a computer, browse through the topic Fractals and find more such beauties. Find the lines of symmetry in this figure. We have the picture of a beautiful figure next to the question. You were just listening to the audiobook Mathematics for Class 6. Narrator Gaurav Marva. Assistance in Production Soumya Malik. Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary. Presented by CIET NCERT. New Delhi, India.